randomized... Oh. Ran randomized Pokemon Crystal Nuzlocke. There we go. And I'll also update it here. There we go. Perfect. Alright. Let's go ahead and get started. Oh, wait. Uh, I also noticed that I still have Oregon Trail 2 set up. Uh, thanks for the donations. This is supposed to be my donator message thingy. And, uh, yeah, you guys deserve that. That should work, right? Oh god, it's not working. No! Why you no work? Hold on, guys. I'm gonna fix that Twitch Alerts thing. Unless it's... No, okay, there we go, I fixed it. I didn't even do anything, but it sort of started working. For no reason whatsoever. There we go. So let's go ahead and uh, hit the continue button. Before we all die. And, um... Yeah, my team is up five because the... Lick, uh, ah, yeah, the Smoochum died. But, uh, did I beat this tower? No, I don't think I did. I think I just got the key, right? The card key? Maybe not. Maybe I'm a step below that. I don't think... Wait, maybe I just didn't fight Rival yet. Okay, I need to go fight the Rival. Slightly forgot. Mass Exodus. Alright. Uh, okay, Melikans. I'm pretty sure you're not talking to me, but if you are, screw you! There we go. Uh, let's go ahead and fight the rival. There we go. You guys got the basement key, so I still have to do this stuff. And, uh... That was just a fluke, huh? We'll see about that. Beat you, like, what, three times now? Anyway, that's a Polyrath, and obviously that's not a good matchup. Um, actually, I don't really have a good matchup for this. Tolkien's probably the best thing, because obviously I have super effective flying moves. I don't want to risk it having a water move. Um, I also have Guillotine. No, we're gonna stick with Fly, I think. Uh, my wife's birthday was fine, Gavin, thank you for asking. Ow, ow. Stop double slapping me, you stupid Polyrath. I could have a Polyrath if I found a Waterstone, but I don't really care. Did Price, Pierce, ah, Price kill Smoochum? Uh, no, I don't think it was Price. I think it was one of his henchmen, maybe. Or, no, I think it was a rocket. Maybe one of the rockets. I think it was one of the rockets. Yeah, one of the rocket leaders killed it. Um, that's a Golem, so I'll let Polyswag handle this. Which I'm going to let evolve into Polytoad, which in this randomizer should be at level 37. And goodbye, Golem. No such thing as Sturdy. Not to mention, Sturdy doesn't actually save you until Gen 5. So, it's all good. And that Machomp, I believe, is also going to be wrecked. Don't know why you haven't evolved it. I think it should evolve by now. That'll do some minor damage, and, uh, yeah, you should be dead now. Excellent. Polyswag EXB, yo. Oh, there's a macho Machoke. Apparently, uh, you're now a fighting-type trainer, uh, rival. How very interesting. Except not. I'm just going to try to use Wing Attack to hopefully kill this. Except for his Golem, of course, because that was a starter thing. Hey, what's up, Expa? And that should be a dead Machoke. As Dakador grows to level 29 and trying to learn Ancient Power. As that is a rock move, I believe I will try to... Oh, wait. That's right, because this guy kind of became an HM slave. Ancient Power is no PP, so... I guess I'm not going to learn Ancient Power. Nope. No Ancient Power. Oh, you asked me a question? Uh, I answered your question, Gavin. I said that it went well. I'm pretty, so fairly sure I answered your question. Oh, counter. That is tricky, sir. And why did I use Guillotine? It always fails against higher-level Pokemon. I don't know, because I'm dumb. I just got, got scared by that counter, so I'm just going to kiss this Hitmon top now. And probably heal... if I can. If I screw anyone dying. Apparently it does, Expa. We now have the answer to that question. And keep hurting yourself, you stupid Hitmontop. 
Although it looks like his, the rest of his team re-randomizes each time. Um, and also is type-specific. Changes, I believe, because I don't think he... I don't think his Pokémon were fighting before. But, uh, I might be just misremembering. Either way, that Hitmontop is dead. And we defeated that Dorito. Why did you lose? That is an excellent question. Probably because you suck. Hooray! Alright, now it's time to... Go ahead and heal, because... I don't want to waste items unless I have to. Plus, these rockets shouldn't pose much of a threat. Not as much as the rival did. Why not? I hope to see you too again, Pokemon Center lady, if you know what I mean. In bed. Never mind. Um, no, what we need to do is go down here and figure out this puzzle, which is stupid and annoying and pretty much is a puzzle I just brute force every time. That is a thing we must wonder, Melikins. And what is up, Tom the Turtwig? No, right, that is a Meryl. Um, so let's go ahead and just fly against it, hopefully. Actually, that bubble beam might hurt. Uh, I did not kill it! No! Dakatoy, you're supposed to one hit KO. Ah, I guess it didn't do that much anyway. Alright. We defeated the Grunt. How splendid. I want to push this button. No, 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 no. I want to get this item. There we go. Hey, a smoke ball. That's an item that helps me run away better. Not that I'm going to give it to any of my Pokemon. Instead, I will just beat up this rocket. What do you have? You have a Nido King. Hey, that's not a terrible Pokemon, actually. Um, but it's still probably just going to die. Smart from the last one and click. Wait, what? Okay, Swankle. See if I can 1-hit KO this, and I should be able to, right? Yeah, there we go. Fortunately, it was such a low level, didn't still didn't give much experience. And I see you randomized into a poison type trainer. And you have an Idarina. Okay. Oh, really, Polyswag? You're supposed to kill that one hit. Whatever. And you have a Nidoran female now. I see that you just kept degrading each time. Although, having said that, Nido King is... If you had just had a Nido Queen instead of a Nido King, you would have had, like, the complete set, but... I don't know. The MVP of the stream is here. Who is the MVP, Swankle? Um... Hey, that's a Pidgeotto! Die! Hey, what's up, DC Puppy Girl? Welcome to the stream. Thank you for tuning in. Um, and I see that you decided to whirlwind me. Okay, I'm just going to finish you off with my chrome then. There we go. So now you have a Blissey. Well, that's kind of annoying. Guess I'll just confuse it, then try to hit it with Vice Grip for the kills. Yeah, I guess it does, Expa. Oh, man. Evasion tactics. And, of course, you managed to hit with Sing. I mean, that would work every time, right? Be hurt, Blissey. I'm going to show you my magnitude and hope that it doesn't... Of course it misses. Can't hit it because it's so small. There we go. That should wreck the Blissey, right? Yeah, maybe? There we go. And the Grunt has been defeated. Well, let's go ahead and uh, wake up. Do I have an Awakening? Probably not. I'm just gonna have to use one of those. You do have full heals, right? There we go. Alright, let's turn on Switch 3. Might as well. And nothing is opened. I'm doing alright. Um, I don't know about everyone, but... Oh. Oops. I never actually bothered to figure out this puzzle. It's always one that you just kind of brute force, at least if you're me. Hey, look! I figured out how to open this thing. Hey, Caitlin, how are you? Yes, I did. Uh, they should be. Uh, until 5.30, so... I wanna hurry. Hey! It's a Cubone! Alright, Cubone. Would you like to be winged attacked? I would wager not, but... There we go. 
Awesome. These ground types are no match for my Dakador. Hey, there's nothing wrong with a little bit of favoritism. Everyone has uses favoritism, in fact. What is a normal day at work? Uh, some programming, mostly support. Uh, pretty much that. <laughs> nothing too exciting, sadly. Let's see, push this button. Um, hey, look! Aw, oh, nuts. Not quite. I can open up this one, but that doesn't help. Eh, I'll try this guy. Eventually I'll figure out how to open this to the end. Well, I already thought, eh, yeah, whatever. Eh, I'll try this one. I probably should be doing this in some specific order, but... No! Okay, number two again. Let's do it. Hmm. Getting tricky. I don't think this is going to do anything if I turn it back on, right? No. Probably not. I'll go with three again. Stupid puzzle. It makes no sense. Oh. Just locked them all up again. You know what? I'm gonna... Believe if I go... If memory serves, I'll reset the puzzle. I think I reset it. I'll go to switch three. Do that. Then I'll do switch two. Then I'll do switch one. Maybe that'll... Maybe nothing is open. Hey, well, at least I got to this guy. Burglar Duncan and his manky. I see that you can be wing attacked. Goodbye, manky. Now you have another manky. Be wing attacked again. Thanks, Gavin. And uh, hit him on top. I always wonder about this puzzle expo. Because I know that it, it doesn't really matter. It matters the order you turn them on and off. And it doesn't really matter if they're on or off, just that they change. I'm wondering if there was a programming error with this puzzle or something. And it looks like it did get to the end. Alright, hi, Murkrow. And I see that you are using ASCII art. Once again, that is not allowed. Not to mention it's probably offensive, so we're going to permanent ban you. Next time, read the rules. Thank you. Goodbye. Uh, Dakador. Oh, just a Murkrow again. By the way, yeah, a Murkrow. That's what killed Kissy, if anyone cared. We defeated this Rocket Grunt. The female Rocket Grunt. Uh, Chrome, I guess you can go out to the front. Really hoping I get a decent fire move. Oh, get lost? Well, whatever. I'm gonna turn on the emergency, so that should make that puzzle break. And there's Max Revive. Definitely not bad. You're not going any further. Alright then. If you say so, brah. Ah, it's a Murkrow. What we should be doing is embering. That was an ASCII Nazi. Not really, uh... Not really anything interesting. Just somebody trying to anger people. Let's see here. Shucky! Let's go over into him. Oh yes, you should be made mod. I don't think that's why you should be made mod. That's because that's why I should have someone I can trust be mod. I think. But uh I don't think it's necessary at the moment. Anyway, Hound Doom is destroyed. Anyone but Fulham. There, Melkin knows. Alright, uh, so a lot of experience for everyone there. Blast it! Indeed. What is it? Oh boy. Hey, yuck, hey, yuck, hey, yuck, I remember you. I don't remember you, really. But I remember some guy going, hey, yuck, hey, yuck, hey, yuck. You're probably drunk, right? Yeah, drunk. Chrome, go ahead and ember this Venonat because that is super effective. And almost killed it. Oh well. Of course you would confuse me. But it is not enough, I'm afraid. That Venonat is dead. Now you have a Venom Moth. Alright. Don't really like being confused, though. We'll let Swankle... Wait, so why did I say Swankle? Shucky. For some reason I read Swankle for Shucky. I don't know. Tom for mod. 
Jeez, you guys really like Tom. I like Tom, too, but we'll see. We shall see. We're not modding the whole chat, that's for sure. Moving onwards, there's another rocket member. How'd I get this far? Because I'm badass. Oh, okay, Tom. Let's go ahead and ember this Ado duo. Sure, Gavin, you are you're a cool guy. Uh, and now there's a little far fetched there. Well, that's a bit far fetched. We'll kill that as well. Your attack went way up, I see. Well, prepare to die. Fortunately, if that's the best you got, I'm afraid that Swords Dance is not very effective. There! Dead far fetched. You got disposed of. Now you know. There we go, TM28, and now I can get the actual card key from this guy. Oh, wait, that was a TM. That's nice. The only way not to get mod is to ask for mod. It's not ask for mod. Well, yeah, that's what Crintio said. I'm much more inclined to mod someone who never asks than I am to mod someone who asks all the time. Uh, let's see, poison powder. Oh, boy. What a useful TM. Having said that, why consider it? Never mind. Eh, uh, it's trash. We will go up these stairs and... Oh no, what'd I do? Hit the Windows button and another antidote! Oh boy. And I can't get into those other rooms. Damn you, work harder! Oh well. Mod is not really... It, it's a responsibility, it means I trust you. It, it's not like everyone should be mod somewhere. What is your favorite generation of Pokemon and favorite gym leader? Uh, my favorite generation is definitely Generation 2. Um, as for my favorite gym leader, that's a tough question. It depends what you mean by favorite, to be honest. But, uh... Alright, let's go ahead and use this card key. I'll have to think about that. I know I answered that probably on my question of the days once or twice, but, um... I don't remember what I answered. There's a lot of gyms I like. Gym leaders. Okay, so that is a Zatu. So what we should do is go out into something that can... I don't have anything that can... Well, I do have Shucky. Shucky should be able to super affect this guy. I don't know what you mean by his offensive language, Gavin. Er, Fulham. Usually pretty well behaved. As far as language goes. You, on the other hand. No, actually, both of you are pretty good with not using profane language. Or at least extremely profane. And a slowpoke. Just what I didn't want to see, to be honest. Polyswag, go ahead and do that. I do have quite a good number of mods. Most of the time, a mod is on. But, um... Like I said, as the stream grows, I might or may not add more. Aha! Be paralyzed, stupid slowpoke! Now you're even slower than you were before! Why no Dark Gym Leader yet? Because I don't know why. It's always bothered me, kind of, Boulder Coon. Uh, why there is no Dark-type Gym. Been in it since Gen 2. And still nothing. Oh, well. I guess because they might... It, they might have a hard time doing it without it being offensive in some way. I don't know. That was actually pretty stupid. Actually, that won't be a 2 KO. Let's see. I should be able to just kill him, to a KO him here with, uh... Is this too much of a risk? I don't know. Let's go with Fly. I think Fly is slightly stronger. If it's not, then I'm gonna cry. Come on, Dakador! Yes! Playing Risky on the edge there, and it worked, for once. Ha! Beat that, Executive Rocket. Let's use with this Hyper Potion to get rid of it. Oh, wow, look at Sal being a diplomat there. Uh, I believe some are much better than others, to be honest, Corinthios. For example, I, I, I strongly believe if you say anything but Gen 1, 2, or 5, you are horribly incorrect. 4 is probably the best generation for online play. At least it was my favorite. 
Anyway. Play script this Remory to death. So now you have a Shelter. Why not? Actually, I probably can just kill this with Ember. Wait, is this... Oh, this is not a... Okay, never mind. This is not a nice type yet. I keep forgetting that. In Gen 1, you know, Pokemon that become part ice aren't ice in their pre-evolutions. I keep forgetting that. At least a lot of them follow that trend. Too much right-wing propaganda in Diamond and Pearl. I can't say I noticed that, but I'm, I'm not going to tell you you're wrong, because I have no idea, to be honest. Rollout, huh? Too bad I'm flying, so your rollouts are going to miss, and it's not really much of a threat at all. And let's just finish you off with a gust. There we go. Hey, there we go. Tolkien is now level 31 as Seal approaches. Um, die, Seal. I'm not really talking about the Pokemon available. Actually, I think Gen 5 is one of the best generations, but it probably has some of the worst new Pokemon in it. At least in my opinion. It has some good ones, but not a whole lot. Um, but I just found it the gameplay fun. Meanwhile, I, I can't play Generation 4 games. They're far too slow-paced. Generation 3, not a huge fan of those either. Generation 2 had Miltank. Well, technically, Generations 2 through 6 have Miltank. But uh, whether or not it's obtainable is one thing. Our Gold and Soul Server are uh, the ones that made the Gen 4 the best. Well, there you go. But it is still the engine of Gen 4. I just... I, I cannot say in good conscience that it's a good engine. It it's always seems slow to me. How slow the little bars go down, like dead. Oh my god! At least gener they fixed that in Generation 5, and a lot of the effects go much quicker, and it makes the games feel much faster paced. Generation 1 and 2 were the good old days. Well, yeah, that's why, probably why I like them is nostalgia, but also they do have a quick pacing to them. Um, I tend to get bored playing Generation 4 games, waiting for the stupid freaking... And I'm not, not even just talking about... I mean, yeah, you can turn Battle Scene off, but you still have to wait for those uh, freaking bars to go all the way down. I mean, yeah, it's, it's not like it's a competitive issue. It's it, Actually, I'm more talking about the... Um, more talking about the single-player mode that that really becomes an annoyance. Don't hate the gen. I mean, I really liked the... I mean, obviously, Gen 4 had a lot of influential points. The special physical split, obviously, needed to happen, and finally did in Generation 4, so it had that going for it. And it was the first generation to your Wi-Fi, which, of course, uh, set off my popularity on YouTube, so... Uh, definitely can't hate on those two aspects. I'm just saying that the engine as a whole was inferior to Generation 5 engine, in my opinion. Gen 7. We'll see if Gen 7 ends up being better, but, uh, somewhat doubt it. Anyway, finally battled here to the last of these rockets. At last. Let's go ahead and heal the party a bit. Yeah. Literally forever, Boulder. Hi, Rocket. Thank you for telling me your whole plan. Now I will shut you down. Um... I mean, the physical special split was huge, but I wouldn't say that's the most influential change that any generation made. I would actually put the split between Special Attack and Special Defense of Generation 2 as the most influential change in Pokémon. Um, and of course Generation 3 had Pokémon abilities, which is also somewhat big, uh, that changed the game completely. And of course Generation 4, all three of those things, the Special Split, the uh, Physical Special Split, and the, the uh, addition of abilities, uh, each one of those generations contributed a lot to the overall game. Uh, and aided the game competitively, for sure. But I would probably put the specials, because the specials being the same stat in Generation 1 was completely broken. There's no way you could have... Generation 1 competitive is a joke. Um, obviously, it has a lot of neat, nostalgic 
weird things, but, um, there's no way that Pokemon Competitive would be able to go very far if it still used that Generation 1 mechanics. Not to mention Generation 2 fixed a lot of the issues with Generation 1 and added two more types. So, I would definitely put Generation 1, 2 as the best overall improvement as far as from a gameplay perspective goes, but the special physical split is probably the second most influential thing. So, I'll give you that. Anyway, so I finally got this bell thing. It means I can catch... Uh, wait, does that mean I can catch... Uh... Suicune now? I believe that's what that means, right? The clear bell. There we go. Perfect. I tend to agree with you, Krintios. I liked it better with uh, before the Dream World abilities and things, though. Uh, Generation 5, you're right, didn't really change many mechanics, but I, I found them thoroughly enjoyable, unlike the single-player modes of uh, Generation 4. Mainly due to the faster pacing, and I found that the uh, errors... The Unova was much more fun to explore than Sinnoh. Why did I go into the PC? I have no idea. Uh, but I guess what we should do is go do. I can believe I can uh, catch Suiku now, so should be interesting to find out what that becomes. First, I have to fight these monks, though, right? Wait, what? Yes, I have a clear bell. Fool, get out of my way! Yeah. I have no idea, Tom. I'm not his keeper. Well, to an extent, a lot of that stuff, you know, it is a bit harder to predict now, Crintio, especially with many more abilities Pokemon can learn and uh, diversity of movesets. But, um, Pokemon will always be inherently predictable because each Pokemon can only have four moves. And you can always... I mean, I don't think that's ever going to change, and dear god, why? Well then. I'm just going to let the stream catch up. Rip Chrome. Firefox. Master Race. <sighs> Gotta love that. Um, I guess Tolkien, go ahead and go out. Gotta always hate those Kapows. <sighs> Alright, Tolkien, let's see if you can do some damage. Sweet kiss that, Scizor. Yeah, it looks like Chrome crashed. That's one way to put it. Ha! Be confused, Scizor. Your massive attack stat will make you hurt yourself even more. We'll never know if, it can, if Chrome could have ever been useful. Uh, I guess we could, we'll see if we ever get a fire TM still, but, uh, I guess it'll never become the best Nine Tails of all time. I didn't know it had Scissor, Melikins. Keep in mind, this stuff is randomized. Um, alright. Kingler. Okay, Kingler should not be exploding in my face. So... Let's go into Poliswag, because Poliswag obviously resists water. Oh man, gotta get hard, huh, Kingler? See how much you like body slams, huh? I guess that doesn't do as much as I would like. I probably should have Gnosis, but... Hey, look, I got a Paralyze, so never mind. Ah, be fully paralyzed, stupid Kingler. Take the item off Chrome. I will try to remember, but right now I have to fight all these guys in order, so I have no time uh, to take that off at the moment. Ow. Attack's doing annoyingly a lot of damage. Alright, Takador, why don't you go back out and hopefully be able to finish this thing off. Unfortunately, uh, Poly World does not have excellent attack. This thing apparently does not have Crab Hammer. Yeah, we really don't, Expa. And, uh... 
I don't think we have anything really as backup that could be really that good either. Polyrath. Only has water gun. Ha! I don't think we do, Boulder. I could go ahead and check, but we'll see what Suicune is first. Keep in mind, Suicune will be randomized, Melikins, into another, uh, random legend. It won't, well, it could be Suicune, but it probably won't be. How did I get Thunder? I don't know what you're talking about. I don't think I have Thunder. Oh, you mean the Thunder TM. Uh, I, I don't remember how I got it, but I obviously do. Also, this thing is scary because I have no idea what Rhydon's moveset could be. Uh, I want to go out into Poliwhirl, but I want to heal first, and hopefully he's not going to, like, one-shot Dakador with anything, because that would be really bad. Oh, you're just going to tail whip me. Sounds good. No, I, I ticked the box that all, uh... All wild Pokémon, including Legends, will be randomized. Keep in mind that Legends will be replaced by other Legends, non-Legends will be replaced by other non-Legends. There we are! Hey, don't worry. Dakador is still alive, Expo. And, uh, Polyswag, I believe you can handle the Steelix. Something I might want to do before, uh... Before fighting the Suicune is healing and getting some, uh, balls. So you never know what, uh, th will appear. In Gen 2, I made one OP pokey. I don't know what you mean by that. But okay. So Suicune could be Articuno, 75% weakness. It could be, Melikins. It definitely could be. Although I'm not really afraid of Lord Peck. Alright, well, I guess let's go ahead and take the item from Chrome. It's just a charcoal, so... I don't think it'll be useful on anything else for now. Yes, let's overwrite the save file, I suppose, as we move Chrome into... Box 14, which is the graveyard. Um, I guess we can look at our backups here. Don't know why I accidentally clicked off of it. As you can see, no real grass types. So, yeah, the game has been screwing us over in that regard. It should be okay, though. Unless it's like something like Articuno. I guess. Alright, so what I want is probably Great Balls. There we go. I probably can get Ultra Balls somewhere, but I'd rather have just a shit ton of... Ultra... Uh, greats. There we go. Actually, you know, it's also buy some Super Potions. I can't really add something I don't have, though. Uh, Melikins. We can get the Cesar for Chrome from the Suicune fight. Hopefully. It could be Entei, or... Moltres, or something else. It could be ho -Oh. Uh, this will be interesting. I don't know why I influ ah, tried to save, really. If anyone's really good at Pokemon Cries, try to determine what those cries are. Um. Wow. Who called Articuno? Dear God. That was spot on. I mean, it's bad for me, but that was spot on, whoever said Articuno. Holy crap. Ah, oh, so obviously Polyswag's gonna be the thing I'm gonna go out into. Um. Oh, it only has Powder Snow. It's not even that dangerous, but, uh... Obviously, we do want to go into Polyswag to, uh... Resist most of his attacks. Body Slam to get down a bit. Actually, let's go ahead and... Actually, it doesn't really matter. Articuno has a ton of special defense. Our Foxy's Pokémon died. Okay. Die, Articuno! Of course, we get another bird team already has three flyers. Okay, so I get to get the Paralyze off, which isn't as good as Sleep. No, wait, no, it's better than Sleep. So we that's good. Um, let's make sure we keep Poliwhirl nice and healthy. I would hate for him to die to a random crit. 
Uh, this is just his default moveset in Generation 2. Keep in mind, I did not randomize these movesets, so Powder Snow, because it's only level 40, probably, it doesn't have Blizzard yet. I don't think it learns Ice Beam through level up. Um, so there's that. I don't know if another Body Slam is gonna kill. Hey! Well, there you go. Bam. Articuno nickname. No, it does not at the moment, Millikins. Kula? Cooler? <laughs> Winter. Only you two- what? Takes Miracle, please? I don't know what you mean by that. Yeah, a lot of, uh... DBZ reference. Elsa, no. No. No, we're not going to make a reference to that movie. Not at all. Wiggy. <laughs> Never, my wife said. Oh man, Jon Snow, Snowshoe? That makes no sense. Using its T robe. That's true. I mean, I'll definitely use Articuno. It's level 40, so. It's definitely better than most of my team. Frosty? Name it Zapdos? I'm good. Jon Snow dies. Uh, we'll go with. <sighs> it seems enough people want me to name it after Cooler Freezer, so. Frieza. I'll name it Cooler. I don't even know if that's how you, you spell it in DBZ. I think it, in DBZ it's with a K, but... Whatever. Yay, everyone's happy! We caught it! Yusin is like, you're surely awesome, you caught Sui Kid. I'm like, no, this is an Articuno. Idiot. <coughs> Hooray, we did it! Let's actually take a look at it. Go catch Smeargle. I have no, like, this is a random, this is a Nuzlocke, so I have to catch the first Pokemon of the round, and no, none others at a round. Anyway, that is a terrible move, so we have to get rid of Mist and things. No, I do have Thunder. Can you learn Thunder if you can? No, still, Shucky can only learn Thunder. Poison Powder? That's, that's better than what you have? Oh. I could teach it Fly, probably, but... I don't want another Pokemon to learn Fly. What about Surf? Can you learn Surf? That ah, Surf will be good enough. Cooler. Surf is a very good move, and obviously, Articuno has decent special. Oh, did I, Gavin? Okay. Um, I do still have those, uh, what is it? These Never Melt Ice. So let's give one of those to Cooler. <coughs> Actually, I have two. I'm gonna put the other one into the PC. I probably don't need two ever. Um, I probably could just toss it. Winds of Winter. Unfortunately, that probably wouldn't fit, Boulder. Oh, wait, what did I want? No, I wanted my PC. I'm gonna deposit some items here. Putting this never melt ice. I'll probably never use the smoke ball. Um. I don't want to deposit things I might use because then I'll forget they're in there. Uh, I guess the two... No, it doesn't really matter. That's fine. I'm aware that Cooler is Freeze's brother, but I didn't know if I spelled it right. Uh, catch Celebi. I mean, I... <laughs> I have no control over what I get the opportunity to catch. I don't know what you're, uh, not understanding about that. Anyway. Let's try to get to Ice Path and then call it an episode. Um... With a little bit of time left, so... We'll try to do that, and then call it uh, the segment. What is up, Psychic Phil? I see that you are a Skiploom trainer. Prepare to die. And you also have a Pararect. The Leech King, if you've been following Twitch Plays Pokemon. But this is dead. Not as good, I'm afraid. I got in the Toxic TM. No, I've not, Expo. Thank you for reminding me about that. That is a excellent suggestion. I have not gotten... Well, obviously it won't be Toxic, but this TM up here. Apparently I missed an item up there, too. Yay, TM36! Find what the hell this is. Mega Horn. Well, that's excellent. Wow. I'm thinking about Tolkien, because 
Tolkien has no good moves at the moment. Damn. I have a Megahorn Pidgeotto. Yeah. Let's get rid of Gust. Wow. This was Sludge Bomb, not Toxic? Oh. Okay, so where do I get to... Uh, you're right. This is Sludge Bomb. Unless... I don't think I can get Toxic TM yet. Let's, uh... It's given by What's-His-Face. I, I actually totally missed what that item was. Oh, well. How? I'm not really sure what you mean. Um... But basically, the first Pokémon I encounter on a route is the Pokémon that I catch on the route. Um, and I can't catch another Pokémon. Yeah, Toxic... Toxic, I think, you don't get until Kanto. Normally, anyway. Uh... So, whatever. Shocky can go out there and not be shocked, and instead use Magnitude. Goodbye, Mareep. I'm gonna feel... Oh, no. Why did you... Really? Four? That'll sting. At least all it has is Water Gun. Goodbye, Chin Chow. And Mom bought me something else. <sighs> Alright, I want to get to the island in the middle. Um, but not... I don't want to catch something in this water. I want to get to the island in the middle. Because that's going to have better Pokémon. So let's go ahead and use a Repel. It should make it so I can get over here. Get this item, too. Dragon Fang. There we go. What the hell's over there? I don't know what that is. Oh, that's probably just a trainer. But no, this is the grass I... Because uh, randomly decent Pokemon will be in this grass. So I'm just waiting for this Repel to wear off. Come on, Repel. There we go. And let's catch a Pokemon in here. Well, we don't need them, but catching a Pokemon is always a good thing to do. Um, That's just a Porygon, though. Not a terrible Pokemon, but not a good one either. Of course, Mega Horn would miss the first time I try to use it. Actually, it probably shouldn't... Oh, there we go. Perfect. Gonna transform yourself into a Psychic type. How pointless. Be caught now. No! Really, Porygon? You would heal, too. No! Stop it! Get in the Porygon! Lego, too. Probably gonna avoid naming it if I can. Get in the Pokeball. You are being harder to catch than Articuno. Alright, I'm just gonna go into Poliwhirl and put this thing to sleep. That might make it easier to catch. And you're going to recover again. Lovely. Actually, let's go for Body Slams first. There. Now you're the normal type. How excellent. Go to sleep. Probably won't be a member of the main team if I catch it. It's too low of a level, to be honest, but, um... It'll be decent backup, for sure. Seizure? I like that, Expa. I'm gonna go with that once I catch this. If I catch it. If I don't just kill it in my anger. Seizure it will be. Well then, let's finish off the rest of these trainers and, um, just get to Ice Path and then call it an episode, I guess. This guy's a Hound Tower. Excellent. Prepare to be guillotined! Oh. Guillotine is so fun, but only when it hits. Come on, guillotine. I know you want to hit. There you go! Yolotine, man. Wiping out that guy. Another Hound Tower. Alright, screw you. Let's go just go for the short thing here. Uh, I don't know, Melikins. Probably just leftovers. That's a Sneasel. You're... Oh, wait, why do you use Guillotine? I meant to actually use... <laughs> if you're gonna make that joke, Fallen, you probably should spell it right. Catch a Hound Tower? I would love to catch this guy's Hound Tower. Unfortunately, that would violate both the rules of the Nuzlocke and the rule that I can't catch... <laughs> You know, the normal rule of Pokémon that I cannot catch other people's Pokémon. And Houndoom is one of my favorites, too. Um, I would love to have it in the party, but, uh... 
probably won't end up happening. Unfortunately, Megahorn has low PP, but it is pretty damn good. I believe it does Expo. So that's why I was using it against that low-level Town Tower, but whatever. Ow, ow. The Flonat Clefairy. Really? Two fly misses. For half sake, Tolkien. You need to get your eyes checked. I thought birds have really good eyes. That's the weirdest looking emote I've ever seen, to be honest. What the heck is this emote? J. Tan style. It's not cropped very well. Oh well. This guy can tell I'm a good trainer just by looking at me. I'm aware that it is quite powerful. That's why I was quite happy to learn it. Um, die Dragonair, hopefully. Oh, nuts. And of course, you would paralyze me. That's wonderful. I'm just gonna switch out now. Because you annoyed me. Ow. Aurora Beam! What's up, Lochniz? I think that's how you say your name. Yeah, cool trainer. Not so cool now, are you, buddy? And that's who I was looking, seeing. Ah, that's who I saw from that grass up there. It's red sprite. Thought it was a Pokemon at first, but like that can't be. No, it's just this chick. Polyswag, I bet you can handle this fire type trainer. Be surfed at. I'm playing Pokemon, but not for much longer, actually. Uh, we will soon. Hey, there's a Hound Doom for you. Too bad I have to kill it. I man. Yeah. And Polyswag is now level 34. And we have defeated Sybil. Okay. Uh, so let's just heal up and save the game. And get on to our second game today. Cool Trainer is better than Ace Trainer. I agree, Expo. Yeah, I went on a, that rant in uh, last episode of what's it called? What is the Articuno named? It is named Cooler. We also have that seizure thing that I'm probably just gonna get rid of the dip party. When I remember. All right, guys. Uh, I don't know about that, Swank. I don't know where they are or what they're doing at the moment, but uh, next Pokemon Justice. It'll strongly. It'll strongly depend on what that Pokemon is, to be honest. But uh, we have to. F we have uh, played Crystal, so let's go ahead and load this game selector thing. Uh,